How are they doing, peeps? And welcome back to the channel. The hat is the hat is off. Bit of a sweat on going up there. But we've come to the little tarn now. Because we are making his way up home fell. And it is ice. All on the front edge here. Which I didn't like today. I would have thought there'd have been ice still on here. We have got one or two nice reflections going round here. So we have got Stainy, NMH photography still with us. And Big Daz is with us too, so we're going to carry him back in his way up, but yeah, this could be a nice little stop off around here. Definitely, definitely a couple of images, I think. Right, peeps. Yeah, so with a nice little composition now. I've got the 24 105 length done. And I am just zoomed in to these trees just over here. Got the ones at this side here, all reflecting. I've done a couple of versions of it so far. One quite tight in to exclude the sky, obviously. Obviously, But I have dropped the camera down a little bit as well, point it down, because you're getting some ripples from the ice as well. So I'm hoping I get that in as well. I will probably try and a vertical one as well, flip the camera around, just zoom in on parts of it, because you've got a little batch of silver birch there, just nicely reflecting. On the whole image, you've got some rocks on this right hand side as well, that have got perfect still reflections. It's fantastic. Got these round here look as well. So I might have a little walk around there. But this side over here, yeah, it's looking looking quite nice, is that? So yeah. First starters, before we get to the top, I'll bob these on for you now. Because we're going a, a little bit further. the light is starting to happen so I'm racing up here but we have got a nice bit of a welcoming committee hello Mookos so yeah I'm gonna try and get up here as quick as I can come goose <laughs> right. I've slightly got excited Cause look over there the Langdales are covered in all in the light and everything I've got the the big boy out I've got the 200 to 600 out at the minute. I don't know if we can see that on the back of the camera or not. But I'm on what? 200 mil at the minute. Just getting the layers going through the valley. We have got clouds and everything over there. We have got a little peak sticking out. I'm not even going to attempt to name all these. But the shots I've got for the time being, I'll bob up now. Because while this light's out, I'm going to carry on shooting. next one I am banging at 600 mil straight onto the Langdales and the peaks because the light is just hitting them down on the composition there's a bit of a wisp wisp of cloud just below it but over there you've got Stainer and Daz just over this little peak down here so I think Martin is making his way up now he's been shooting the reflections but all round here look it's looking absolutely fantastic so yeah a couple more shots coming your way
one now. I've zoomed a bit further back out. I'm in at 200 mil. I've got just the valley, the distance right at the bottom, at the very bottom, so it frames the Langdales that are just getting lit up. All the cloud that's getting lit either side of it. Yeah, this is an absolute peach, is this? Absolute peach. You've got the layers as well at the start, so yeah. It's making it, yeah. This is a banger. This is a keeper, is this? Well and truly. You've got the different tones in the sky. You've got the blues at the top of the fells. You've got the whites as the sun's hitting it. And the peak is just in that top top part of the cloud. So yeah, I'll bang this one on now for you. Because I'm going to start and now, if you look around here, it's all starting to disperse and wrap itself around the fells. So yeah, it could be a nice, could be a nice panel coming as well. But for the time being, I'll bob this one on now for you. down a bit <laughs> for that bit of a light show the light is just starting to come down on the back of sides look over there so it's casting down there on the humps and hollows steve has just been chatting a cow up down here nice bunch of cows there so he's been getting cows excited so he, he might suddenly appear with a big smile on his face if he does he'll wonder what we've been talking about won't he <laughs> but yeah the light again is catching all the fells all the look the cloud and mist just going round and round so yeah, the Langdales are lighting up again. So yeah, taking a blittery shot of them. So yeah, a few nice images. So yeah, I'll bob these on for you and then we'll contract Steve on his way back up here. I told you he'd have a smile on his face, chatting them cows up over there. <laughs> you saying them giant pandas? <laughs> <laughs> you see, thought he were a panda. <laughs> so it's not his tripod, he's chewing bamboo, really. Martin and Daz are here now, look. Both got smile on the faces again, because they've been with the pandas as well. <laughs> it's been pandemonium. Pandemonium. <laughs> you always get one, don't you? <laughs> anyway. Back to compositions. I am now, I've zoomed back out, I'm at what, 250 mil now. The Langdales are still lit up and the valley is just getting a touch of light on the bottom. So it's creating a layered effect going through. The low cloud is on the right hand side as well. And with the telephoto lens, it really is taking you straight through to the back of the Langdales at the moment. The light is just casting as well on the low clouds all over the look so and it is coming behind us. So yeah, it's getting a bit interesting, is this? Hey, right, peeps, I've just had the drone up. So it'll be one or two drone images and a bit of drone video. I've got time lapse going as well. So I'll end with time, lab time lapse and images from the drone and stuff like that. So yeah, if you've enjoyed this as always, please give us a thumbs up. Big thanks for watching. And I'll link Steve's and Martin's videos below and channels and all that. Because we've had a cracking afternoon up here. It is starting to dissipate now, all this low line cloud and stuff. The light is fleeting, but yeah, I think we, I think we made the most of it, let's say. So yeah, I hope you enjoy the images and I'll, I'll see you again on the next one. Bye for now.